It's been called many things. The ultimate exercise machine, some kind of space age contraption, the stealth jet of exercise equipment. So, what is it? The story of the Quick Gym ROM machine begins with time, your time, and how you manage it. With all the demands for your time from work, family, friends, and obligations, is it possible to have any left over for exercise? In this program, you'll see how it's not only possible to add hours to your week, but how you can add years to your life simply by using the Quick Gym ROM machine that gives you a total body workout in only four minutes. We'll also take a tour of the ROM factory so you can see firsthand how the Quick Gym ROM is manufactured and why it's the most advanced and efficient machine ever made. The ROM machine, which means range of motion, is the brainchild of John Petrie, considered by many as America's leading surrealist and social commentary painter, selling more prints worldwide than any other artist. His paintings address the themes of ecology, overpopulation, the mysteries of the universe, and the fragility of life and of relationships. In addition to being a talented artist, John Petrie is often called modern-day da Vinci, holding over 30 patents to his name. Through his scrupulous study of human anatomy and the arts, he came to design the world's most advanced fitness equipment, the ROM Cross Trainer, which was awarded the Popular Science Best of What's New Award in 1991 for the greatest achievements in science and technology. But the inspiration to invent the ROM machine didn't come from a desire to win awards. It came about to solve a simple problem. How to get a complete workout in the least amount of time. The question challenged his creativity and passion for invention, and he soon began assembling a gem of sorts from leftover parts borrowed from the mines around Telluride, Colorado. His self-made gem eventually evolved into what he called the Time Machine, reflecting the time savings benefit that the ROM Cross Trainer offered its users. In 1990, John Petrie approached Alf Timmy, a pioneer in the health and fitness industry, to manufacture the Quick Gym ROM Machine. With ALF's manufacturing expertise and his high standards for quality and precision engineering, the ROM underwent changes in industrial design. He streamlined the ROM for easier manufacturing, and it took the shape it has today, which hasn't changed much in over 20 years. With the ROM factory based in Los Angeles, California, ALF found himself in the center of the fitness explosion that was occurring at the time, and the ROM machine had the perfect home to thrive in the growing industry. What was being sold then, and still is today, is the myth of time. You need 30 to 60 minutes of exercise to get any benefit. Feel the burn, knock yourself out, more is better. It's a dangerous myth. When you spend that much time exercising, you don't see the results fast enough. You get bored or injured, and soon start skipping workouts. Then, you just quit because you simply don't have the time. In their study of physiology, John Petrie, along with Arthur Jones, the inventor of the Nautilus exercise machines, discovered that if a higher percentage of muscles were worked out intensely for short periods of time, this could provide all the muscle building, stretching, and cardiovascular conditioning most people need. Dr. Lawrence Morehouse confirmed Petrie and Jones's findings and implemented the principles of high-intensity training into NASA's fitness program for its astronauts. Science. That's what the Quick Gym ROM machine is based on. But the fitness industry isn't about changing the status quo. They want to sell you equipment and gym memberships that they hope you'll never use. The Quick Gym ROM machine is manufactured almost entirely in-house by ROM Fab of California, where only the most meticulous and precision craftsmanship is accepted and the most durable raw materials are utilized. It's constructed of DOM tubing and solid cold rolled steel, stainless steel, aircraft grade parts and bearings and employs the highest standards of welding, grinding, polishing and plating. The Quick Gem ROM machine has 137 state-of-the-art engineering advancements, each with its own patent. Unlike other exercise equipment that's only meant to last until the next trend, the ROM machine will not become obsolete. It's extremely durable and built to last a lifetime. Let's take a look at how the ROM machine is made from the time the raw steel comes into the factory to the bending, laser cutting, welding, polishing, 
plating, vinyl assembly, and ending with your machine being crated and ready for delivery. Two kinds of raw steel come in, flat and round, also called bar steel. The bar steel first gets cut to length depending on its intended use, for example as the back footsteps or the front handles. Most bars get a ball nose machined onto them for better aesthetics. Then they're smoothed out by a grinding process to remove the small holes or pitting that all raw steel contains. From there it's on to bending. The bars get bent to form the back steps, the front arms, and the frame. After bending, additional holes and threads get machined in where needed. When the bending is complete, parts get welded together. If you take a look at most exercise machines, you see sloppy, coarse welding all over it. But with the Quick Gem ROM, great care is taken to remove visible welding and to create the strongest bond possible. The lack of any visual signs of welding demonstrates the attention to detail we put into each Quick Gem ROM machine. All flat steel goes through a similar process, but first gets laser cut to make the frame, seat, back and footrests, and the flywheel. The flywheel, which is the heart of the Quick Gem ROM and provides the resistance, goes through several stages of grinding, balancing, and polishing before the holes and slots are machined in. Chrome plating and powder coating, along with upholstery, are the only things that aren't done in-house. But prior to chrome plating, all parts must be ground down and polished so that the chrome finishing is perfectly smooth. Painting the parts would be the cheap and inexpensive way out, as this extra grinding and polishing needed for chrome plating wouldn't be necessary. But when you're building a world-class machine, cutting corners isn't an option. Once all the cutting, bending, grinding, welding, polishing, and plating is done, the parts get assembled, first into 16 sub-assemblies. Then those 16 sub-assemblies get put together to create one Quick Gem ROM machine. Hand finishing and inspection ensures that every detail of each Quick Gem ROM meets the full standard of excellence for construction and durability. At ROMFAB, every detail and every step along the way is designed with the highest standards in mind from ordering raw materials to shipping the final product. ROMFAB has even designed its own custom storage racks for holding parts to keep them safe and sound in the warehouse until they're ready to be used. The wood containers used for shipping the Quick Gem ROM were custom designed specifically for the ROM machine to provide the best protection during transportation. So the machine is really nothing brand new. We've been making it since 1990. Um, I was 49 at the time. I've been using it for 21 years. And um, now at age 70, I can still step on the machine, and, uh, which I couldn't do uh, with 49. And I also became very flexible. I can sit like this for a long time. And then getting up used to be a problem 21 years ago. Not now. Or, if I want to get my socks on in the morning, I can do that standing now, which I couldn't do when I was 49. Quality, craftsmanship, manufacturing without compromise. The ultimate exercise machine that leaves you with more time to live a healthy life. But the Quick Gem Raw Machine is not for everyone. Only those select few who have the highest standards and seek life's peak experiences. Are you one of them? For more information on the Quick Gem ROM machine, give us a call or visit us at quickgem.com.